The trial for the shooting death of 29 year old Jonathan Styers began today. Now, Styers was shot and killed in 2016, and Peter Cahill has pleaded not guilty to second degree murder. Vanessa Danabalan reports. As Phil, the trial is happening at the John Sapinka Courthouse in Hamilton, and the jury of 12 is now reduced to 11 because one person had to be discharged. Those remaining heard from Timothy O'Keefe, who was a Hamilton police detective at the time on the case in 2016. During the cross-examination of the detective, the defense brought up some evidence about a business card that was found in a pocket of the deceased. The card on the front had the name of a real estate company on Main Street West, and on the other side was handwriting that read Highway 56. No more details were released. Jonathan Styers was shot and killed on February 4th, 2016, outside of Peter Cahill's home on Highway 56 in Binbrook. The second witness was Judy Chin from the Center of Forensic Sciences in Toronto. She told the jury that she does gunfire distance determination, specifically trying to determine the range of fire. She told the jury that the muzzle of the shotgun was less than 12 feet from defect 2, which was the gunshot wound on the chest. And when talking about the gunshot near the right arm, she said the distance was more than 1 foot and less than 12 feet. The agreed statement of facts admitted by Cahill were read by the Crown that on February 4th, he shot Jonathan Styers. Styers died as a direct result of the injuries and the shotgun recovered was Cahill's. The Crown also showed evidence to the jury that included photos taken by detectives of the home where it happened, the pickup truck, as well as blood samples that were collected. The trial will resume tomorrow at 10 a.m.